so walmart was an off campus opportunity it was for the summer internship for software development profile uh, the hiring was done through the spark plus coding challenge uh, in which the first section was an mcq round in which we had to solve around 30 questions in 30 minutes the, and then there were two coding rounds uh, both the coding rounds had had two questions and the second one was relatively difficult than the first one uh, it was open for all the branches and the cgpa cutoff was seven Uh, so our profile was software development role and both of us were assigned to different teams and were given different tasks. For my team, I was under uh, developer productivity platform in which my task was to develop a common UI library which provides high level React components for Walmart internal sites for minimizing the development efforts. Uh, my team was on the backend side and uh, it was the personalization team in which we had to run algorithms and develop algorithms to improve the user personalization and user search result. For my resume, the first thing I did was to consult seniors. They guided me on how to prepare my resume. Uh, the resume consists first consists of your past internship and projects. If you don't have any past uh, internship, it's fine. You can move to the projects part. Uh, you can include two to three projects. If uh, you have given uh, coding contests on various platforms, you can include all your coding profiles and you can include the PORs that you have. Uh, other than that, uh, there's a format that runs in our college. You can uh, uh, guide to that. Okay, so for the interview preparation, I used to give contests regularly on Code Force, Code Chef, and Lead Code, which helped us a lot in improving our problem solving skills. For precisely going through the interview part, uh, you can watch. Uh, like for the explanation part you can watch the uh, youtube playlist from striver the way he explains the question we should follow the same way same approach during the interviews and for the mock interview is also important so for that uh, there are seniors at code ism and code electronics conducted mock interview rounds which helps us a lot in analyzing our mistakes Like all the three of their equal importance uh, for the CP part when you will be giving the online coding challenge uh, CP will be the most important go into the interview round the interviewer may ask from your DSA and as well as from your projects as well so you should have a clear understanding about your project as well and for making resume as well uh, the project section covers a very important part so knowing development is also important so the main thing is uh, you, you need to maintain maintain you need to give equal time to all the DSA, CP and development. the ideal time to start preparation is like uh, the start of your second year or the mid of your second year while starting the one should have clear understanding of all the data structures uh, have at least two to three web development or any development projects ready in your resume and the uh, most important thing is uh, give contest regularly and keep on absolving the questions which you could not solve during the contest time and uh, also give mock interviews to your friends or to your seniors and the most important is uh, uh, while you are appearing for any interview please read the past interview experiences on gfg or any other platform When there are many WhatsApp and Telegram groups that you can join, regular information are circulated there. Also, be active on the LinkedIn platform. Uh, on the companies, major ones uh, do post their openings there. Also, the workers, employees uh, who are in the company currently, they also uh, post the regular openings. Uh, other than that, be in touch with your friends and seniors and be active on the groups uh, that you have created with them. They will be sharing the information there. Then after you recognize any off-campus opportunity, the first thing to seek an off-campus reference is to go on LinkedIn, search for the company's name and see who are the alumni working there. You can uh, text them in uh, LinkedIn. If you have, if you by chance manage to get their contacts, uh, you can message them in WhatsApp also. And uh, if there is an opportunity to refer you, your seniors can get back to you.
so we already knew there would be a uh, interview round before the ppo result based on the manager's feedback there were one or two interview rounds for each candidates uh, uh, upon crossing the interviews only uh, the ppo results were out and uh, uh, one important thing was that you should maintain a uh, proper bonding with all the teammates especially mentor and managers and should complete all the works before the internship ends and uh, since the manager's uh, schedule would be quite hectic and he won't be able to meet you every day uh, try to try to maintain a daily record of your work and like in a 3 to 4 days if you have done a significant amount of work do send him the update of your work through personal messages so that he keeps in mind that what you are doing and if you are doing any mistake then he will rectify it and also keep on make, maintaining a daily record of your work it will help you a lot while when you will be preparing for your final present condition and do discuss with the mentor for the challenges which you are facing and how you are approaching it when pors have absolutely played a major role they help you to enhance your leadership and management skills uh, there is a particular section that should be there in your resume for the pors and you should include all of those there uh, during the interview also whenever the interviewer ask you about your college experience or any of the extra curriculars you can always tell about your pors or you can always deviate the topics or uh, try to include the pors as much as possible during an interview. you so you can showcase your uh, talent and work that you have done in college Uh, i would like to say that uh, never lose hope uh, if you do not get selected in your day zero or day one uh, do not break down keep working hard uh, try to realize from your mistakes you will definitely get selected in one or the other company uh, your batchmates seniors are always there to help you and support you